Hey, what's going on YouTube? Tomasa 8 here. You asked for it and I'm giving it to you. The Alpha 9 Pro Touch 3.1.2 Jailbreak. I know I took a while to do this, but the reason for this is because I, you know, I had no reason to update, but now I did, so I'm going to show you the jailbreak process. And you guys know that my videos are the simplest and quickest videos, and that's what makes them special. I only have 10 minutes, so let me get started. First things first, connect your iPhone or iPod Touch to the computer. And once you do that, head over to your internet browser and go to blackrain.com. Um, it's not an I, it's actually a one, so it's B L A C K R A 1N.com. If you can read it, I will have it in the description. And you should see this website has to do with a whole bunch of iPhones around him. Um, scroll down, and you're going to see a Windows logo and an Apple logo, depending on which one you have. Click on it. So if you have a Windows PC, click on the Windows one. If you have a Mac, click on the Mac one. Just click on it and download it. Save it. Save it to somewhere that you're going to be able to open it. Don't save it to somewhere and, you know, it'll get lost. So you just save it. Um, I'm using Windows 7 right now, but it's the same thing for pretty much all of them, including the Mac one. So if you're running Windows 7 or Vista, right click it and hit run as administrator. Don't just open it. Right click it and put run as administrator. Mac OS X users just, you know, just click on it. And you will see this for you that have a Windows 7 or a Vista. Click on yes. And you should see you should see this. This is a little square. It says make it rain. Just click on that. Bam. Enter recovery. And your iPhone will appear like it's turning off. You will see this. Everything is normal. Um, this just came up. It's no biggie, you know. Uh, this should appear in your iPhone or iPod Touch. Uh, avoid all of the stuff that iTunes is going to tell you. Uh, right here, enjoy your jailbreak is done once this, this device reboots. So it's pretty much done. Uh, yeah, like, it, it only takes about 30 seconds, guys. Mine is pretty much done. Look at the little spinning wheel of hell, death, or whatever you want to call it. I call it hell. Um, so yeah, if you know, if you get to up to this point, you're pretty much done. Um, there are some rare cases that iPhone 3G users get some sort of problem. There's a fix for that. I do not have the video yet, but I should have one. Uh, but you know, that's only sometimes. Sometimes that it messes up with the 3G users. Um, uh, you know, but yeah, that's pretty much it. When you get that dude on your iPhone, you're pretty much set. Just wait, be patient, and avoid anything the that iTunes says. Just hang in there, and bam, slide to unlock. It's pretty, it's done right now. Um, if if it's done, well, if it worked properly, you should see black rain. It it should be on your second home screen or the first doesn't matter as long as you have it it's like a it's like a black raindrop black rain right there click on that open it up and it's loading loading available installers so pay attention because you're definitely gonna want Cydia you you actually need Cydia to download all the jailbreak app, jailbreakable apps um so yeah just click on Cydia um, if you want, you can download Rock and Icy. I don't, you know, I don't, if you want, you can download them, but I find no use for them, so I'm just gonna skip that. It'll probably make the process faster. So just make sure you click on City and you have a green check right next to it, and then click install on the top right. And bam, downloading City. Right now I'm on 3G. I forgot to, you know, put, put in the Wi Fi. Um, but, if, like, try to put in the Wi Fi before you install it. Uh, my wife, my Wi-Fi has a long web key, so I didn't want to waste time downloading Cydia. And yeah, guys, once you have this, you're pretty much done. Just install Cydia, and then you officially have a jailbroken in Apple, not by touch. See, it only took us a couple of minutes, two minutes at most, three at most. And, uh, yep, just downloading Cydia. Let me put it right here. On top of a Julius Caesar book. I will fast forward this so whoops 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 um 
make sure that the iPhone is not going to sleep mode. That's you know, be aware of that. Do not let it go. To, do not let it go into sleep mode. That's a big no no. Do not let it go into sleep mode. So when you see the screen get dim, just touch it so it look it back to being bright. Okay, so the iPhone just rebooted. Um, if everything works properly, you should see Cydia. And yeah, that's it, guys. So if you want to know what to do next, just go look at my video called What You Should Do After You Jailbreak Your iPhone Up at Touch. It's pretty simple, guys. And this was it. Make sure to subscribe, comment, rate. Tell my say eight. Once again, make sure to subscribe, comment, rate. Tell my say eight. Out.